Good morning, Panthers. Today is Tuesday, February 9th, 2021. Please join me for a few moments of morning prayer and reflection. Let's begin with our mission statement. St. Anthony de Padua Catholic School develops lifelong learners who live their faith through stewardship and are committed to Catholic virtues and academic excellence. St. Paul compares the body of Christ to the human body. Just as our body has many parts, the body of Christ has many members. All people, no matter their race, religion, or nationality, are part of the body of Christ. Jesus came for all people. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. A reading from the first letter of Paul to the Corinthians. For just as the body is one and has many members, all the members of the body, though many, are one body. So it is with Christ. For in the one spirit, we are all baptized into one body. Jews or Greeks, slaves or free. And we were all made to drink of one spirit. So whether you eat or drink or whatever you do, do everything for the glory of God. Give no offense to Jews or Greeks or to the church of God, just as I try to please everyone in everything I do, not seeking my own advantage, but that of many. The word of the Lord. Think about this silently in your heart. If all people are one in Christ, how should we treat people, especially those who are different than us? Holy and loving God, though we are many, we are all one in you. Help us recognize you in others. May we practice love, compassion, and mercy. We ask this in Christ's name, amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. This morning's reading tied beautifully into our virtue for this week. Our virtue of focus is unity, the strength to be one in mind, heart, and soul. So unity. The opposing vice of unity is separation in ways that um, we're led away from the virtue of unity. And sometimes we find ourselves in the vice of separation when we insult others, call names, criticize, lie, blame others, compare others, share things publicly that should remain private. Those are all things that take away from us as one body. So this week, let's make sure we focus on seeing Christ in one another and remembering that we are many parts, but we are all one body united in our love for God. Please join me in reciting the Pledge of Allegiance. Today, our flag comes from Alexandria. Thank you, Alexandria. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. Thank you so much, Alexandria. All right, Panthers, we don't have too many announcements. There's no birthdays today, so a very happy unbirthday to everyone. Thank you all so much for your contrib contributions to the Super Bowl. I see a lot of food in those boxes, so thank you for everything you brought in. Today was the final day, and so I'm sure we'll have some announcements at the end of the day or first thing tomorrow to let you know how the Super Bowl ended up. Um, but I, it's great seeing all the food that you brought in. So thank you very much for that. Please continue to be safe when you're walking to school and this afternoon when you're walking out to your car as there are some icy patches. Those of you at home, we hope that you are doing well and staying warm as well. Please reach out to your teachers if you have any questions about your remote learning, but thank you for your efforts at home. I know that is a challenge. This weekend is Valentine's Day, so Friday we will have a day where you can wear a Valentine's shirt uh, color. So we'll look forward to that on Friday. I know some of your classes might be doing something special to celebrate. I think that's all we have today. So before we sign off to begin our Tuesday, let's recite our St. Anthony Faith Pledge, another way that we demonstrate unity. We, the students and faculty of St. Anthony de Padua Catholic School, vow to be Christ's light for the world. May our eyes see Christ in one another. May our words speak, may our mouths speak words of love and kindness. May our ears listen for ways to serve. May our hands reach out to help and may our feet walk closely with Jesus 
so we may live in his light. Jesus, light for our world, shine in us and through us. Have a great day, Panthers, and St. Anthony de Padua, pray for us.